So you've been looking to create a sales funnel in your business, but you don't know where to start or what platform to use. Well, that's all gonna end today because today I'm sharing how you can build your sales funnel and how you can create a really profitable one using the platform Kajabi. Let's go ahead and dive right in. Misfits, Brittany Darrington here, and welcome to the Corporate Misfit Club channel, where we help female coaches, course creators, and consultants to build a freedom-bound business, sharing their expertise through their digital products. Now, before we dive into talking all about sales funnels and what they are and how you can build a profitable one, I want you to check out the five sales funnels that every course creator needs. Now, this will break down some really popular funnels that you can utilize, such as webinar funnels, lead magnet funnels, and so much more so you can find that below all right so let's go ahead and dive right into what the heck a sales funnel is and how you can build an absolutely profitable one on Kajabi now if you're not using Kajabi and you're using one of the other platforms perfectly fine but I will show you some examples on the platform that I use which is Kajabi and you kind of see how I go about creating a actual sales funnel using this particular platform okay so a sales funnel is going to be a journey that you take your prospective buyers on you're going to put opportunities opportunities in front of them where they can actually buy. It might be things like a tripwire or on your checkout pages. You might have something called order bumps and you're going to have opportunities that allow your customers to go from a lead or a prospect to an actual buyer. Now I love sales funnels because it's a way for you to generate revenue in your business consistently and also be able to do things like upsells and downsells, order bumps, and allow your customers to see the different types of products that you have within your business. Now, we experience sales funnels every single day in our lives, and maybe you're not familiar with digital sales funnels, and maybe you've heard of sales funnels a while back, but you're like, what does that look like? How do I actually implement that into my business? Well, thank goodness we're doing this sales funnel summer series because you're going to be able to learn how to be able to create your sales funnels from scratch and ultimately be able to implement this and get this into your business. Now I learned about sales funnels back in the day when I used to work at a country club where I was a sales director. So I handled getting in all of the new enrollments into the country club. We had golf, we had tennis, we had all these amazing features, but my goal was to get new members in. And one of the things that I would love to do whenever I was in my sales process, I would try to find ways to upsell them. And through that process, I would ask if they were interested in joining other clubs or going to go travel to other clubs around the world, I would find out more information about if they wanted more access to the club beyond just maybe golf or tennis or whatever it is that they were looking to utilize it for, maybe just for business. And I would find ways to upsell my customers. And if it was the right fit for them, they would take me up on that offer. It allowed me to crease my bottom line and also put my products in front of my customers at the right time. So I want you to think about some sales funnels that you might encounter in your day to day life. Maybe you are experiencing a sales funnel while you're at the grocery store or when you're getting your nails done or some of the other places like maybe getting a car. You experience sales funnels in a different form day in and day out. Now the digital version of a sales funnel is very similar to that but it's just in digital form. So I love how Russell Brunson really broke down how to create a sales funnel through his own platform and it helped me to see wow as course creators, coaches, and consultants, we should be doing exactly what we do in day-to-day -day life and create upsells and other opportunities within our actual business. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take you behind the scenes of my sales funnels that I utilize in Kajabi. I'm gonna show you a tripwire sales funnel, a webinar sales funnel, so that you can just get an idea and a glimpse of what a funnel is and how you can utilize this into your business so that you can get one up in no time. I want you to spend this summer not only thinking about a sales funnel, I want you to also create a sales funnel. So then you are ready to go, you're able to generate some sales and generate revenue and ultimately be able to turn on that machine that works 24 seven for you and also helps you to take things to the next level and scale your business. Okay, so let's go ahead and jump behind the scenes. Let's take a peek at some of my sales funnels and see how you can utilize them in your business.
Okay, so right now I'm on the back end of Kajabi. And currently right now, if you are just jumping into Kajabi for the first time, you might be asking where the heck are pipelines and also what are pipelines? So I like to look at pipelines like the sales funnels for Kajabi. This is where you're going to build out your sales funnels. This is where you're going to put all of this into place so that you are able to send your customer either from a lead magnet or send them to a sales page or give them some sort of freebie, whatever it may be, we have pipelines here. Now the beauty about pipelines in Kajabi is that they have blueprints. So what you're going to do is what you're, if you're first coming into the platform and you have no idea where to find pipelines, you're going to want to make your way to the marketing area under marketing. You'll then want to scroll down to pipelines. And then from there, you're going to want to hit new pipeline. Now, the really great part is that Kajabi has these blueprints. So let's say you're looking to do a freebie, which is just a lead magnet sales funnel where you're going to give an opt-in, you're going to have an email on the back end and a thank you page. Kajabi helps you to see this blueprint and also gives you a better understanding of what it is so that before you start creating it, you know exactly what you're going to be doing and understand the purpose behind it. Now there's several different platforms or pipelines that you can choose from, such as sales pages, product launches, coaching campaigns, free book, Zoom webinar, simple sales funnel pages. Um, also there's some legacy pipelines where you can choose from some of their past pipelines that they have created and you can utilize those. The only thing about these particular pages is that they're usually a little bit older uh, in terms of the type of page. It's not as up to date as the pipelines above. Okay. So these are just a few pipelines on the back end of Kajabi. I want to take you behind the scenes of our actual pipelines that we create or sales funnels that we create and show you a sample of some of our pages so you can get a better understanding of what you're capable of doing on Kajabi and also how these sales funnels work. So for example, let's say that you were going to do a lead magnet type of funnel. So let's just say you're going to do an opt-in and you're going to go straight to a thank you page. Well, what could that look like? So right now I am looking at one of our templates that we sell where you can get designed for you templates and you can plug in your colors and plug in your copy and just customize it to your brand, which makes it super simple for you to utilize it on Kajabi. So with that being said, we're going to look at either a long opt-in or short opt-in. This is going to have our freebie on it. And then once someone opts in by giving us their information, they're then going to go to a thank you page. So let's take a peek at this short opt-in. So what happens here is you plug in your information, give all of the great benefits of why you should join or get a part of this community or should download this freebie or watch this video, whatever it may be, you're going to put that compelling headline there and then plug in your information. And once they decide to move forward, then based off of the pipeline design from what we were looking at with Kajabi, they're then going to go to a thank you page. Now that thank you page will say you're in, here's what to do next. You can kind of give them the scoop on what their next action steps are going to be and whatnot. And so it helps them to better understand how they're going to get to that next place and be able to continue on this journey with you. Okay. So let's look at another pipeline and also kind of look at some pages that can go along with it. So for example, let's say you're going to do a zoom webinar, a zoom webinar, or just a webinar in general, you're going to have a registration page, a confirmation page, a sales page, and then check out what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you a registration page, a confirmation page and a sales page. So let's just hop right to that. So let's go to a registration page for a webinar. Let's click here. So what's taking place right here is a webinar um, registration where it shares more about what that webinar is going to be about. Reserve your seat, gives you some benefits, tells you to mark your calendar. Here's what you're going to learn. Gives the whole rundown so that someone can get excited and join the actual webinar. Now from here, as we see, there's a confirmation page. So let's go to the webinar confirmation page. Now what's going to happen is now you have your confirmation page. This is where you can tell your audience, congratulations. Here's what to do next. Make sure that you tune in and maybe even plug in some other things that can help them to ensure that they show up. 
Now let's hop back and see what else is needed. Next is a sales page. So what we're gonna do is we are going to now go to the sales page. Once we click that, now the sales page can be able to explain more about the offer, give someone the insights of why they should join your actual course. This usually takes place after someone has gone through your webinar. This is when you're usually promoting this at the end, telling them that if they want to move forward with the information that you have been sharing and take that next steps, then they can go ahead and check out the sales page and move forward. Now, you don't always have to follow this blueprint. You can go straight to a checkout if you wanted to. So you can always skip a sales page if need be and just go straight to checkout. But ultimately, this is a funnel that is taking place and getting your customer to the actual purchasing stage. So again, with Kajabi, there are several blueprints that you can choose from. You can tweak these and make them your own and adjust them accordingly to what your needs are for your customers. But as you can see on the front end, with the pre-designed templates that we have just shown you from our collection that you can check out if you're interested in it. But you can see that these pages can all connect to one another and create the front end of your sales page. Now on the back end of your sales pages or the back end of your sales funnels, you're going to have things like emails that take place that also help to move your customers customers further along. So this will help to be able to get them from a prospect or a lead and get them to actually purchasing, making up sales or order bumps or things along those lines to increase your bottom line. Okay, so there you have it. There are some sales funnels that you could take a peek at as well as if you want to check out Kajabi and give it a test drive and see if it's a fit for you and your business and what you are looking to do, then I definitely highly recommend that you check out one of our trials. It's something where you can go in risk-free, you can see if it's a good fit for you, play around with these pipelines and see if it's going to work. Also, we are giving away a sales funnel that includes a thank you page, a tripwire, a sales page, and also an opt-in page for free. It's already pre-designed for you and all you have to do is just sign up for Kajabi see if it's a good fit for you, and then we'll share the instructions on how you can edit that template to be your own and look on point with your brand. Okay, corporate misfits, so there you have it. There are a few sales funnels that I utilize in Kajabi. Now you have a better understanding of what a sales funnel is and where we're actually placing things to present them in front of our customers along the sales funnel journey so that they can go from a lead to an actual buyer. Okay, so don't forget to download the five sales funnels that every coach, consultant, and course creator needs. You can find that below. And also leave a comment letting me know what type of funnel you are looking to get started with. Is it a webinar funnel, a lead magnet funnel, or what are you looking to do within your business? I wanna root you on and cheer you on along the way. Okay, I'll see you soon. Hey there, Corporate Misfits. Thank you so much for watching today's episode. Go ahead and hit subscribe so you can be notified of some of our upcoming videos.